So a tragedy happened 23 hours ago. The Thunder Blunder 777, better known as Blunder, lucked me in monotype random battles. I know, I know. It's a lot to take in. We'll pause for a second. Just kidding. We're going to keep going. But yeah, uh, that, that man lucked me. And I, <laughs> I'm still in shock. And then I play Malatai Random Battle going for rank 1 on, on stream with Envy. And Envy was just losing every game too. So today, I'm practicing. I mean, Envy loses every game versus me anyway, Malatai Random Bats. <laughs> Shout out to Envy. Uh, but today we're practicing because I got to get my luck back to beat down Blunder. Now, I, some do say, and I am some, that say that... Uh, do things run will o wisp I don't remember. They're usually banded, right? Um, some do say, and I'm some, that I gave Blunder the win because he did just drop his agency merch. But me, I still don't want to. I, I I can't. Next time I play him, I gotta I gotta sweep him. Obviously, I have to sweep him. So yeah, honestly, guys, like I uh I was gonna record some OU today, but I was I just sat down, had a few teams, and I was like, I'm not really feeling it. Like I'm I'm really not feeling OU uh, much today. Or much right now at all really do I did I make the wrong play assuming that this was choice ban elite it did 24 but I'm an avalug whatever man don't matter you can data max in this broken metagame anyway we'll go Glaceon I 1v1 you yeah that did nothing to see we're good 39% absolutely nothing I'm actually gonna go for toxic because ice beam is not gonna do a KO and I have freeze dry anyway but uh, I had a personal goal on twitch of hitting rank one on uh, Monte random battles, and it's very very hard because obviously you get some uh, insanely lucky matchups, and then like even look look at the guy. Dude, number one is like seventy eight point five GXE. Number two is seventy five point nine. So like nobody here has some ridiculous GXE, um, except for this dude. Sylveon is so cute, You're killing it. You killing it, Sylveon. But yeah, anyway, I plan on toxicing here and landing. Yeah, there you go. So that way I can beat it down with my Avalog by just clicking recover. So that's okay. But uh, yeah, guys. So I'm really excited for Crown Tundra. I've very much been enjoying National Decks. Now, there's some aspects of it I don't like. Uh, Z-moves, I don't like very much. I'm not a big fan of Hidden Power. I think Pursuit is interesting because Ghosts are amazing. And I'd be okay with it coming back. I knew I know the reason like Pursuit isn't in the game is because... It has to be like a, a game mechanic thing because every single generation they mess up pursuit, right? And then just like the idea of doing that to like Dynamax Pokemon and do you attack the big mon? Do you attack the mon that explodes after if it switches out or what, what are you actually doing with that? I don't know it definitely has to be a coding issue, but I For sure can't wait because the aspects I do like I love using heat ran um, Because it breaks stall like very easily it just magma storms and taunt I uh, missed a couple times when I was playing National Dex too. It felt, it felt, it felt all right. It felt like, hmm, this is home. This is home. These things are usually sub, if I remember correctly. Uh, sub Earthquake, Pain Split, Poltergeist, I think, or Shadow Sneak, whatever. I think I can go out to you and why am I sub heavy to do boots? Do not. I'm gonna win this game with Cloyster. Uh, I'll go Lapras as a Poltergeist there. And what I want to do is just get this thing on a timer. Like they don't always run, uh, they don't always run, what's it called, Will O Wisp. And if I shell smash in front of this thing's face, it doesn't have an item. Oh, I don't have an item, so they can't poltergeist me. And I will, I will risk it in front of this thing. So I'll just go for Ice Beam, get some chip. There we go. Now when I play, they don't have Wisp. But I don't know. I don't know if this is the mod I should set up on. Maybe it isn't. Maybe it is. I felt like I'll set up on another Poltergeist mod. I'll set up on something else. I'm gonna get rocks first because I'm just gonna get. I'm not gonna kill it with Blizzard anyway. And if I do, it'll probably be after poison regardless. Oh my God, it got back up to 100%. <laughs> you annoying mod. What am I doing? Let me just go Avalug and wall this thing. <laughs> Who cares if I'm burnt? I will 1v1 you. You will not beat me 1v1. I got hail and poison chip. But yeah, I'm so excited for that. I can't wait to use Top of Coco, Lele, Bulu, Feeny. Uh, it's crazy to me that. It's, it's crazy to me that Bulu is UU in National Dex, right? And then Silla Steel and stuff. Those are mods that are not going to be UU. Especially when Bulu gets Grassy Glide. Or when Kartana. When Kartana gets Grassy Glide. <laughs> Yo, that mod is going to kill it. 
Oh no. They missed. Oh no. This is still probably be close to a kill. Actually, is that still 60 base power? I have to, I have to get hit first, right? For that. Or is it just last? I always mess it up with payback. Power doubles if the user was hit by the target. I have to get hit first. Doesn't matter. So that thing dies. But uh, yeah, I, I can't wait. I want to be able to use, I think, cart with Grassy Glide as well. Like, in the last generation, uh, one really good team was like Magnezone plus Bulu plus Kartana. It, it didn't matter if you were Scarf, Car. Uh, it didn't matter if you were... Um, man, why did that kill me one hit? It didn't matter if you were Scarf, Car. I need some damage on this thing before I beat it with uh, Art Dizzle. So, it didn't matter if you were Scarf, Car. Didn't matter if you were uh, Bandit on that team or Swords Dance. It was always really... Why am I born with Zerg, man? Gonna be the broken one. These guys too. These guys as well. Gonna be getting a lot better too. Anyway, this move doesn't miss, and I can dodge Focus Blast too. They could also Dynamax at any given point. Now look, I'm saving my Dynamax for Cloyster. I'm for sure saving my Dynamax for Cloyster. Are they Poltergeisting me? Because I can Shell Smash on this thing with Cloyster. I don't know if they're. I don't know if they're tricking me, but I'm gonna switch. Did they Poltergeist? They Earthquaked. All right, it's time. They may Dynamax here. <laughs> they might just Dynamax here. But they're usually choice men. If they don't Dynamax, they're going to lose. They will indeed lose. Perfect. I'm sorry, there's just no way this doesn't kill. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm just excited to use these things. Like, I think Kartana with uh, Grassy Glide is going to be broken too. Because Kart, choice ban, doing that type of damage? Insane. Max Geyser and a Max Geyser, just in case they max back. Yeah. I need the bulk anyway to eat their hit. Oh, and the second one KO is perfect. Perfect, and I'll live their hit. Uh, shout out to Max Moves. Ah, nice, nice. I told y'all the Cloyster Endgame was happening. Who doubted? Yeah, who doubted? Who doubted? That's it. Take that blunder. But I've been down to maxing first turn. It's actually been like, I, I, if y'all didn't see that video, we actually got the Audino video up, by the way, if y'all want to see that as well. It's on Blender's channel. Um... So that should be a lot of fun. These things are usually Sash, from what I remember. I don't want to take an Earthquake. I guess they could Mega Kick. But I don't want to take that. As they Body Slam. I still took that decently well. Hey, they didn't get the 49, so they didn't get the 51. So, they did 48. We already know how that works. I think that's fine. Manti maybe could have been saved, uh, because they're Mono Ground, most likely. I mean, I don't know if they're Mono Ground. <gasps> Ooh. <laughs> Hello, my child. They go koki koki on you right here. Little Kingler coming through. But yeah, I can't wait for that. I think that like all the tiers are going to be messed up again, but I think OU is going to be incredibly fun because we're going to have so many breakers. And that's my thing about OU as well right now. Like, we don't have, I don't know why they test the Cinderace. The community clearly said at least give Toxpex a test. And a lot of uh, like leaders like Finch, for, oh, he's not a leader right now, but he's still on the thing. He also wouldn't like be against that sort of thing. So I feel like it should have at least happened, even if it didn't get banned. Right? It should have at least happened. I have the king. Oh, that is so much damage. <laughs> Bro, okay, they're probably going to calm mine up, but I can live their hit after unless they got a max. So I'm a toxic anyway. Just get some chip off on them. Maybe Psy Shock. Well, if I was level 100, I'd Psy Shock because it'd probably do half. But Is this thing dual screens? I want to keep my slow king healthy. So I'll switch. And I can defog in your face as well. I have a Shifu. Let's go. But yeah, Slow King is going to be my way of dealing with this. They're model normal as well. Which is cool. So I'm just going to Steam Eruption once. I'm assuming they get up a light screen if they can. Yep, and they might get up a Reflect after, but we'll defog right here at least so they only have a Reflect. And I get rid of the uh, the hazards, so I don't mind them getting up a Reflect. I mean, most of my mods are special attackers anyway. So that's cool. I mean, that, that works out for me. No rocks on my side. Now bring out your broken one. Where's the gooner? Bring out the goon. I know it's there. Thing is, if they Dynamax, uh, if they go for Combine with Indeedee and then Dynamax, it's a problem. So I probably have to stand and attack it. Oh, there it is. You meet again, my friend. Okay, Urshifu is fast, but not faster than Indeedee for whatever reason. So I'm just going to Steam Eruption. They ain't doing no type of damage on me. Where's the burn? I swear this move does not burn. I thought I had the same chance as Scald. With 95 accuracy. That's a lie. This move should also have like 32 PP. 
Be real, because he will stall me out. Maybe I should toxic it, but they could have heal bow. If I... It's so fast. It's so fast. Miltech, why are you so fast? Just the nightmares this mod brat. One of my favorite Pokemon. But yeah, can't wait. I'm going to get Latios and Latios back. They got Mystical Fire and what, Aura Sphere and Nasty Plot. Oof. I think Tornadoes is going to get banned too. Which is very sad because it gets Nasty Plot as well. If Megas come back, I could tell you straight up, Zam going to get banned for sure because that mon gets Nasty Plot as well. There's, there's, there's a common theme in this. <laughs> They're all Nasty Plot, but... I don't know, I just can't wait to use Bulu. Why would you do it this turn? Like, what if I get the... Ah. Okay, I feel like Agility King can win. Right, let me just go Snow King. Um, I don't think they have Heal Bell based on what they're doing. We'll see. We'll see. But if I can get a Toxic off on them and they don't have Heal Bell, I'm good. I mean, at least wasting... Ref Reflect shouldn't matter too much. I really want the Toxic off on Indini, though. Because Obstagoon is a threat if that thing comes out. But I can hopefully Dynamax uh, Kingler and live a hit, even if it bulks up. Like, if they go hard Obstagoon right now, that'd be a problem. But at least Toxic is better than Burn, so it lasts more turns. And if they can't Dynamax and DD, I don't think it can kill Kingdra. If I can get a Brain, I can also win as well. But they could have a Ditto as well. They probably have him Pheasant. Normal always gets him Pheasant, and that Mon always messes me up. But yeah, so I think Cart's going to be busted. Um... Can't wait to use Blacephalon in a metagame. Like, we see how good Ghosts are in this metagame, right? Age of Slash, Gengar, Dragapult, of course. Can't forget Dragapult. Um, so it's just, you know, it's going to be nice to be able to... Uh, it'd be nice to be able to you know, kind of just use them from there, I guess. You could say. I can live this. Let me slack off. Because if they don't crit me, I'll get back even more. I can agility up on them with Kingler. Or I'll go for that. I'll sack this to two poison turns and then try an agility up on them with Kingler. Just flamethrower. They could be thick fat, so I'd rather do less. Actually, this is usually Sap Sipper, right? Yeah, they died. All right, time not to lose to Ndidi, hopefully. Because if they calm mine and I get a steam eruption off and I burn them, it's a wrap. It sucks though, because they had Toxic, which I didn't remember. I gotta try to remember these sets. If I want to get him. Okay, I do want to get rank one of those. In terms of the road top 10, I do want to go back to that as well. Like, I'm sure if I get one good team that I like, I can you know, potentially do really well with it, but it all just depends, right? All right, we're in Toxic here first. Please don't miss because they are going to hurt a lot. Please do not miss. They calm mind up. I am. I I will probably lose. Actually, if they if they uh, Dynamax, I might win because they can't kill Kingdra if I Dynamax back. And I'll get up the rain. Uh, and that means that Kingdra will outspeed them. And with the turns of Poison, I should be okay. So I need Toxic to land. No. I need to be able to get that residual damage. Indeed, a threat. I swear that's an Umphezen at the end. And I'm about to get blown away by it. Uh, it's Erwin Guru. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. This thing has Thunderbolt and stuff. Would they Thunderbolt immediately? I'm risking my king, my Kingler. They did. They they would Thunderbolt immediately. The answer is yes. They would Thunderbolt immediately. <laughs> Man, that hurts. Uh, my end game isn't looking as clear right now. Because I know that indeed he's going to blow me back. Okay. Whoa, I made a good play. Let's go! I see playing my face. Okay. So they'll die. And then they go out into what? Persian? They go out to Persian. And fake me out. Or U turn, I guess. Oh, they go in DD first. Alright, so I'll get skull damage off on them. My entire team is slower. Yeah, I, I think I max here. Do I? I think I sub as they max. Because they're going to outspeed me in the following turn anyway. But Oh my god, they max guarded. That's amazing. Okay, so I think I win guaranteed now. Because I sub... 
I sub. I kill them with drain. They have hyper voice, <laughs> but I don't think that matters now because I just uh, max geyser into max geyser and I think I win. Because expanding force won't kill me. Oh, I'm sorry, but this mon is way too weak to do crap. I don't care if you're banded play rough or whatever the hell you are. Yeah, I won. GG. Let's go. I forgot they had hyper voice. <laughs> maybe maybe I should have attacked on the last turn, but I don't think it made a difference in the end game. Kingdra was still doing it. Let's go. Yo, they made that trick room play. Put me back in that game real quick. I think Kingdra still might have been able to do it, but I don't know. I feel like Ndidi could have been crazy, especially because they avoided me getting a Toxic off of that. There's some sleeper Pokemon that I'm really excited to come back to. Like I think Metagross is going to be really defining in lower tiers. Um, I don't know if it gets like body press, but I think that'll be incredible for Metagross. No, not you. Cortana. These things are usually Sash, though. I don't want to break it Sash if it is Sash. Alright, it was leftovers. Cart can win, so maybe I shouldn't go out into it, but screw it, man. I'm gonna do it anyway. Don't get a fire move. You're not gonna focus blast me right here. You're just gonna do 9 million percent with that move. Exactly. Give me that mod. This is Cartana. Give me a beast boost. I feel like it's it's really telling that uh, two YouTubers' favorites here right now, and I'm referring to me and Blender. Or Blender and I, but uh that it's very telling that our fail, oh my god, this thing 6 owes me. Oh, thankfully, my opponent decided not to die to max or do anything and go for Psychic. Oh my gosh, thank god that mod is dead. But I think it's very telling that, um... That one of our favorite tiers right now is... And we play a made-up meta, made metagame, right? But our favorite tier right now is uh, a made-up metagame that is even more jank than the made-up metagame we play. I think I should not have done that, but I don't think I really had a switch. Well, depending on what they bring out. Oh, God. D -D 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 -D. Good, they just went for expanding force, thankfully. Get my damage off on them. Because I need that for, uh, I need that for, for my mod in the back. Forgot the name of it. Verizon. Rizion, obviously. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. What you doing out here, bro? 39%. Okay, so what I don't want to happen right here is them... Do I max air scream here? I think I max air scream. I think I do. Because I should live their hit, right? Yes, they crit me, unfortunately. But I max air scream, which means uh, I'll be faster than the next mon. Okay, cool. Whatever. I don't think that matters. Does it? Who knows? I don't think it matters. I just need to make sure that uh, Ndidi is dead. Because G-Max jump solo will definitely knock you out. They still do have D-Max in the back, though. So, I mean, I can still lose. It's Psychic versus these guys. But, okay, it's you. I don't know what that means at all. It's faster than me. All right, so that means probably death. Okay, I'll let him die to match there. Max Mind Storm. If I defog, I get rid of the terrain, but that doesn't do crap. Maybe I live Max Mind Storm into Max Mind Storm. Oh, that is going to be very, very close. Okay. Leaf Storm damage. I don't think I win with Grass Terrain, but they can miss. All their moves can miss. Uh, I don't know if that if I should I should have attacked them or anything before. I don't know if I would have made a difference. Game, dude. Yeah, that was tough. <laughs> All their mons had psychic moves, and they had a fairy in the back. They had double fairy, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I, I should have uh, if I attacked with Rillaboom would have made a difference. I don't think so. I think I needed to kill Lele and keep it. Oh, I love you, Blaziken. But I'm about to die to Volt Tackle. I really am about to die to Volt Tackle. Last sleep talk, bulk up ice punch. What the hell? Y'all see this set? 
Who does this? You bulk up ice punish them, bro. They're about to go Zapdos, which unfortunately does have Hurricane in this. This is why I got the bulk up ice punch, bro. Who did this? Who thought, hey, let's give this mon one move. Let's give it ice punch. That is the play. All right, now I three KO them, guaranteed. They're trying to get that spadev drop. Yo, wait, hold up. This bulk of ice punch stuff might just win. This bulk of ice punch might just win. Hold up. <laughs> this might be the wave. Hold up. I'm feeling it. But yeah, like it's also like really hard because like I love recording megas to high ladder at blunder. I think that's extremely fun. Um, so like on days that we're not recording that our WB is like, what do I ever really record? Oh, bulk of ice punch was not the wave, ladies and gentlemen. I have to find on this bad boy. <laughs> and we're getting damage on Rotom Eat. Let's freaking go, baby. Mmm. I mean, I wish this had rocks. What I need to do is find a situation to Swords Dance with Blaze again, because once I get two speed boosts as a wrap. I guess I could Swords Dance into Max Guard, but that's not, like, doesn't look like the smartest. They could have Stunfisk. Maybe they do have Stunfisk. Maybe I should have CC'd, but... I mean, I get two chances to hit this Stone Edge. There's one. They gave me the fight on Phalanx, so this might actually be the game... Well, this might actually be the game where Phalanx does something. Keep you around, because you get a hit. Don't call it a prediction, folks. I ain't ever left. <laughs> That's not the phrase, but it doesn't matter though. Toxic going in. That was the one I wanted to set up on. This Pikachu about to volt tackle me. It's from Sinnoh. I at least died of recoil. Dude, I'm gonna get static if I go you. But Lucha's fast and everything. I don't like clicking quick attack here, but okay, they didn't. Good. Maybe they're lightning rod, but who knows? Better man, damage on you is worth. That did not do the damage that I thought choice band quick attack would do. Whatever, man. I'm gonna keep. <laughs> I'm gonna keep. <laughs> that looks more likely. <laughs> you're gonna give me a Pokemon, and you're gonna like it right now you're gonna give me a pokemon and you're gonna like it right now oh i'm glad it's magnezone you're gonna give me that magnezone and you're gonna like it keep, keep dynamaxing keep doing whatever you want thunderbolt right now i don't feel like manetric was the play there i think i definitely max because thunderbolt's not gonna kill me don't paralyze me yeah, I max, I max Flare, get up the sun. Uh, I max Guard in front of Helios because it can't max Guard back, and that'll give me enough speed to be faster than it. And then Close Combat should win the game in theory after damage. I just go for another, I just go for another, uh, another max move. Is the sun hurting them? Oh, the sun's hurting them. I, I probably just win right here actually. Cause this just kills, right? Yeah, let's go, baby. Blaze good. It's good to be back. There's another mod I want back, and I'm, I'm tired of that garbage. Oh man, this is a complex band. We can't allow Blaziken without speed boost because we expect everyone to be five years old. Oh, this dude is really high up on the ladder. I can see why. Where the hell are my counters? Where the hell are my counters? Worth. Worth. Mono Rock versus Flygon. I don't know what they're bringing in now, but I'm doubling to Terrakion on here. That was uh, ungood for me. That did not work out for me. Unfortunate. They were just throwing away Doug Shiro too. Very unfortunate. <laughs> All right. Well, that did not work out. Unfortunately <laughs> for me. Well, the standard dot I gotta kill is this Joey. That's it. It also happens after they hacks you, 
But right here. Y'all. Yeah. Standard dot. You already know it's me from the beginning, but you have to reveal it after you kill a Pokemon. It's when you keep your name safe. Everybody knows that. That's a standard dot. That is the standard dot. Why is it mono ground versus mono rock? <laughs> they definitely have a size and toe too. I try to go Terrakion and hit something like... Like literally anything coming in on me that wanted to do damage. Not Dugtrio though. They can try to reverse on me. They are going to reverse on me and kill me. Unfortunately, cannot do anything about that. It's nice to have a team. <laughs> Go, Carbink. I choose you. I wish I had a team that could win this game. I can't even, like, set up brain with Kabutops because they definitely have Seismitoad. Oh, that's cool. Good game. Yeah, I can see why you're top 10 on the ladder. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that is somebody who's top 10 on the ladder. I remember seeing the name Sylveon, is so cute. Yeah, the number three. Well, matchups like that. See, this is what I'm talking about. Nice and fair matchups. I'm gonna get a my T-Spite. You better have a Water Poison. Oh, I'm about to say Skrelp, but Toxapex also works. What you got for this sludge bomb? What you got for this sludge bomb right now? Show me. Show, don't show me anything, honestly. I hope you lose to this mon. I hope you do. I hope you do very, very much. Good damage. Uh, I want to keep this thing alive. It's very good. I feel like Bob Plum makes a lot of sense because it can just scrim set back all the damage they do. Okay. Mister, I'm gonna get up hazards on you. I'm just gonna click Giga Drain now. I don't think you have a switch in. I stayed in. That's severely unfortunate. Now, I'll be honest, I really hope I do not lose the Mono Grass versus Mono Water matchup. There we go. Right back. Right back. I gotta have a T Spike eventually. Even if they have Misty Terrain, that doesn't really matter. Valplum is just an annoying mon, though, for mono water in general. I don't have sleep powder, though, which would make me more annoying. I have aromatherapy, which I don't think matters too much. Who cares about skull burns? Now, there are some demon waters they could have, like Kingdra. Kingdra's a pretty big, big one. Sharpedo? Okay. Goodbye, Sharpedo. <laughs> you deserve a good rest. <laughs> And Valpum's back at 100. <laughs> they better go Goliath's ball. I'm going to shrimp side first. After their first impression, then I'm going to go for Giga Train. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Good game, buddy. Yeah. Oh, my God. Now Valplume. Oh, my God. Just hit me. I'm so sorry. Fight back. Is this a wrap? Oh, they got the Psychic Storm? Max oh, it's Max Geyser. No! <laughs> Good game, dude. Oh, it still does 52% to Maris. Get up. Valfum at 100% by the end of this. What was that, man? What was that? <laughs> Unfortunate. That's like, that's literally the last matchup I got versus the dude. Oh, why would you reveal my giant threat? Turn one. Neutralizing gas. Do I lose this game if I just click player up? I feel like I don't. This is a choice banization. Why would you have this as my lead? I have a lot of other good Pokemon. The SC gets body press now? That's awesome. My team is fire. Not him. Not the mod that's 6 on my team. I wish I clicked Crunch. I really wish I clicked crunch. I think I lose immediately. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Knock me out. I didn't want to play this game anyway. Let's click random T spike. Not like I have any attack to hit him with. 
There you go. Didn't want to win this game anyway. Hey, buddy. You want to do some damage here and not die to their attack? This young, why can't you Dynamax? I know you're broken. Well, that's the whole game, guys. That's not half the game. That's the whole game. That is the uh, whole game. That's wrong, RP. Everybody knows that's the whole game. Because I cannot touch this Pokemon. There you go. Nice Max Knuckle. Can you win? Maybe. Maybe Focus Blast crits. There's no point in putting up webs. I need Chip. All right, my friend, your life orb. Thank you. You killed one Pokemon, but all my offense is gone. Not really, but like my webs are gone. They Dynamax though. Hmm. I don't soundproof on this thing, do I? I'm on a psychic. You know what? I'll just go for it here. Maybe I'll win this speed tie. I did. Nice. Bug buzz is nothing. We'll go for another max starfall. Maybe I'll win this speed tie too. That'd be really good. I'm on Mr. Mime trying. Trying as hard as oh, I would love for them to give me clay at all. Because that ore beetle is set up fodder. I don't think going for max line storm is a play ever versus uh mono psychic. I'm sure they have a Necrozma Dust, Dust Man or, or something crazy on me. I don't know why they went Uxie as well instead of sacking the Orb Beetle, but I'll take every Mon you have. That is a threat. Send out Necrozma Dust Man. Like, you're toying with me at this point. Send it out. Not the pony. Keep you alive. Get my Diamond Storm defense raises. I just need a little bit of damage. Mr. Terrain ends. I cannot toxic this thing because of its ability. Which, it should actually not be able to be hit. Wait, wait, how does it pass off you? They're going to do the same type of damage. Moonblast twice. As I said, data. Pokemon and allies cannot be poisoned. It should also make you, like, be immune to just... All attacks that are poison as well cool okay so I think I beat this thing 1v1 I think if they're shy sh if they're side shock I got the special attack drop too nice if they're side shock I'm good cuz is not that fast they're Moonblast, not doing anything. Deancey, thank you, my friend. Get another special attack drop. You already know Moonblast is one of the most broken moves in the game. How are you? Uh, let me let me, let me me tell you why the pros in Moonblast. 24 PP, so great PP. 95% base power with 100% accuracy and a 30% chance to drop the opponent's special attack. Moonblast is one of the most broken moves in the game. There is a reason. There is a reason. That they don't give it to half the Pokemon. Diamond Storm, you too. You ain't gonna do no damage to me. <laughs> can't drop my, can't drop my stats either. And this gets the double defense raise. Let's go. Hey, what are you doing? Whatever. Moonblast twice, so I don't miss. DNC, you are okay. Not bad at all. All right. Well, we ended with that. Um, I mean, I got back some points from an MV loss last night <laughs> everyone won game it was very funny but I'm not, I'm not gonna lie he had some terrible matches like he had like a some disgust okay I'll get one more actually I want to try and get to the uh, push to the uh, what's it called to the 1500s never mind I've lost I feel all hope is lost they just lead off with Zygarde just broken Zygarde <gasps> I have an ice beam slow bro what a good mod what a good counter model psychic looks pretty fire <laughs> to be honest I don't got all the good ones, but slow bro and Zam, that's all I need. Wish I had Ndidi. Very much wish I had Ndidi. Uh. Am 
my friend? Are you gonna click Dragon Nest? Are you gonna click Thousand Arrows? Or what's going on here? Are we doing it? Dude, did I just get predicted? The answer is yes. Am I gonna scald anyway? Because I am a, a slow bro and there's no way in hell I'm dying to this attack. Hell yeah. And I'm gonna get rewarded for this because I got this on my draft league team. Hell yeah, we are. Oh, I know how to play this. I teleport right here. Get up our young rocks. Just in case, you never know, you know. Get some damage off on you as you spin away my hard earn hazards. All right, didn't didn't want that anyway, I guess, right? Put my ice beam right now. I bet you Jinx could have won this. I don't have to reveal it too early. Shout out to the boots, though. Jinx is strong. Yep, yep. And Clay all just Claydol. Give me that. All right, so we got rid of some giant thrusts like Claydol. Quagsire. 49%. On the low. On the low. Give me this mon, dude. This is match. There is such a big difference. Why did that only do 55? I know it's a lot more, but still. Very, very sad. All right, so I'm, I'm thinking they're going to try and go all in with Zygarde. Um, I think I wall this thing with my, uh, with my slow bro, which is very funny. I have Shadow Sneak as well. Cool, cool. So, I'm going to sack this and keep Zam alive just because it's stronger. Plus, it takes two life orb hits. Nice. Okay, bring out Galate. Click that sneaker. There we go. Route to bro we go on the Zygarde. That should be okay. It's Dynamax Max Hailstorm. Don't even predict. Not about to get crit by, by Zygarde. Oh, oh, this is gonna hurt, my friend. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Who last? Send him out. Oh. Oh, it's Groudon. It's regular Groudon. I don't mean like, oh, it's regular Groudon, like, oh, this isn't a threat or anything, but I can get up the rain. <laughs> Go for another one. All right, get a little bit more chipper there. I think we switch. Oh, which I happen to be faster, which is awesome. So I knock out God on my life force. I mean, I had elegance him anyway. It's knock out anyway. But I'm pretty sure Scald into Psychic knocked him out. So, I mean, I'm glad. We ended up hitting 1500. Good game, dude. I ended up hitting 1500. Um, that was a Groudon in the back. Pocket Groudon, by the way. So I hope y'all enjoy it. You know, we're just chilling. Something nice. Got some megas to high ladder coming out tomorrow. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.